so here's Nateo, and this is the same day, just a different session, so later on in the afternoon. And we had a bit of a breakthrough. Uh, and sadly, my phone <laughs> was dead, but luckily Timothy came out and brought me some SWAT so I could uh, put that over his face. But we bonded over uh, getting the bugs off of his face, so then he was very appreciative of that. Um, and so that was a very good boy. And even he had a little bump on his nose, so I wanted to make sure um, that I got that covered up. And again, he he is pretty good about um, you know having a nice brain on him. He's not super re reactive. If he doesn't like something, he'll leave. But he lets me kind of get up. He has a little nick, and uh, we really want to be proactive about the bugs down here. I'm just using SWAT uh, at the moment because I can put it around his eyes and it does a good job of keeping the flies off but also because he's so thin his immunity can be a little low and so what I have to be careful for is that then things don't turn into summer sores from the bugs so uh, it can be kind of a problem but luckily he's letting me um, put that on him and he's sniffing me out there and he's kind of letting me flip his mane over. So again, this was like a big breakthrough for him today. And we're both a little cautious of each other. So he's letting me rub and he comes in for a little sniff. And, and then we both kind of take a step back and take a breath. And again, just giving him those rubs. And it was such a warm day, and he had such a thick coat. Um, so Timothy went and turned the water on for me, and I was going to see if I could just uh, get him with a little bit of water. But I had to get him over to the hose first. And yes, I am wearing shorts. <laughs> it's a pretty warm day. I normally wear my riding pants, but I kind of just came in for a quick little session and it and it grew a little bit. But just working on getting him over to the hose. We're still learning to come off the pressure of the halter. But he's doing it pretty well. And then generally with these guys, I um, just like to show them the water. They tend to get pretty curious about it and will go and kind of bump it and want to play with it, which is what he does. I think that's a pretty nice feeling thing. And then I was able to kind of spray his shoulder there. And that's a kind of like as far as my hose goes, so. It's fine if I, again, I'm just trying to get him, because he just got so sweaty and um, tacky just from it being a little bit warmer than he's used to. And it, it's killing me. I want to just give him a bath, but he's not quite ready for that. So, I'm, again, I'm just going to let him feel a little bit of the water. And he's handling that again. If he feels comfortable to kind of touch it with his nose, that's what I really like to do with them in the beginning. He's actually drinking from it. Well, he's he's pretty reserved still in his personality, but uh, it's coming out slowly. And again, here I'm working on a little bit of pressure and release. So anytime I ask. And I soften to him. And just see if I can get a little bit further up on the shoulder. It's so funny how they generally like it. Okay. Again, kind of showing it that it's okay. He's every Mustang is different where they can get comfortable, and he's a little bit more comfortable if he can touch things with his nose first. I've had a couple that don't want anything to do with the face, but. 
That's how he tends to like things, but he's letting me get the shoulder a little bit there. So I was really happy with that, and uh, just going to end the session there, and uh, just get a little bit of a uh, yield here where he follows my body, and then just finish up with a nice little face rub. But that was really, really good. I was really pleased with uh, how he accepted things today, and we're moving forward.